Hi guys, welcome back to Calculi videos. We're back with another uh, different, separable differential equation. In this case, what we have is e to the power of negative y times parentheses dy over dx plus 1 equals x times uh, e to the power of x. So to be able to solve this problem, first of all, I would like to isolate dy over dx. So that's why I have to get rid of this e to the power of negative y. So that's going to be equal to dy over dx plus 1, it's going to be equal to x times e to the power of x divided by e to the power of negative y. Okay, then it's going to become dy over dx equals x times e to the power of x times e to the power of y. So that uh, negative exponent, uh, it's going to turn into positive exponent and it's going to be equal to dy over dx is going to be equal to a. So it's going to be like this. So dy over dx plus 1, it's going to turn into x times e to the power of x plus y. Okay. So it looks like we can't do, um, no, we can't separate the variables. Okay. Because this, this uh, second expression still involves the x variable. But what we can do is uh, we can do a, a substitution, u substitution. So when I do the, when I do the u substitution, the things are going to get easier. So let's see how it's going to turn out. So if I said x plus y equal to u and differentiate both sides implicitly with respect to x. Okay. So when I when I'm differentiating both sides with respect to x, it's going to be equal to dx over dx plus dy over dx equals du over dx. So and we know that dx over dx is 1. So 1 plus dy over dx equals du over dx. So I'm going to keep this thing. I'm going to be using as a replacement. And also I'm going to be using this x plus y equal to u as a replacement. Okay. Then so for the uh, original equation right here, so whenever whenever I see dy over dx plus 1, I'm going to replace it with du over dx. So I'm going to use different colors. So du over dx equals x times e to the power of 4x plus y. I'm going to replace it with u. Okay. So now uh, it looks like we can separate the things. So then du equals if I multiply each side by dx okay what we're going to get is x times e to the power of u times dx then we're going to divide each side by e to the power of u so when I divide each side by e to the power of u what I'm going to get is e to the power of negative u times du equals x times dx so now you see that things are being separated so now as a last step I'm going to take the integral of both sides so when I take the integral of both sides, what I'm going to get on the uh, left hand side will be negative times e to the power of negative u equals on the right hand side only x squared divided by 2 plus c. Okay. Then let's try to uh, solve this equation for u. So first I'm going to uh, multiply each side by negative 1. So what I'm going to get is e to the power of negative u equals negative x squared divided by 2 minus c okay then i'm going to take the natural log of each side because i would like to get rid of this e okay so when i take the natural log of each side the left hand side will be negative u equals natural log of negative x squared divided by 2 minus c then as a last step i'm going to multiply each side by negative 1 so we get u equals negative natural log negative x squared divided by 2 minus c. Okay, so that's going to be my solution, okay, my general solution. But there's only one thing left to do because I would like to, um, so for u I would like to put uh, y. If you remember that u was equal to x plus y, in this case I'm going to re replace u with x plus y. So it's going to be equal to x plus y equals natural log negative natural log negative x squared divided by 2 minus c. And to get the y by itself you need to subtract 
x from both sides. So then my final solution, final solution will be y equals negative natural log negative x squared divided by 2 minus c and minus x. So that's going to be our final solution, general solution to the given differential equation. All right, guys, thanks so much for watching this video. Please stay tuned for the next video because in this uh, in the next video I'm going to be doing one final differential equations. All right. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.